Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. This is going to be part two of my Tuesday morning beach walk in North Naples, Florida. Down at the south end of Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. It's about 8.15. Probably about 70 degrees. Beautiful here, partly cloudy skies. Park is already starting to fill up. A few little waves rolling in here. Not bad. Water temperature about 76. We'll look down to the south down Vanderbilt Beach. Hit that share button if you're liking what you're seeing. This isn't going to be too long of a live feed. I'll walk up the beach here at the park for a little ways. Out here with one of our friends, Norbert over here. He and I are just taking a beach walk together this morning. He's visiting from Germany. So you'll probably be hearing him and I talking here. It's kind of busy. I've been seeing a lot of people walking the beach this morning. This holiday week. Parking lot one right over there. I think there's a few more spots. The park has been filling up super early. I heard they opened up early this morning. My friend Norbert said he saw the gates open at 7.30 this morning. Hit that share button. Saw some gorgeous colors earlier this morning. Boy. After I finish this, go back and check out this morning's Daybreak live feed. It was beautiful. Beautiful glow over on the eastern horizon. There's our beautiful Florida sun. Mm. So I'm going to start walking back down the beach here. Okay. Are you famous? Uh, Are you famous yet? <laughs> I think so. Are they asking for autographs? <laughs> Are they sending you stars on Facebook? <laughs> oh man. Sent the link uh, to some friends. Nice. Yeah. So they can see how beautiful it is here. Absolutely. Well, what we got to do here is I got to turn around. And you have to say hello to all your friends in 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 Germany and here. So you can you can do it in German. You can say it in German. Go ahead. Guten Morgen. Es ist so schön hier. And good morning. So beautiful here. Isn't it beautiful? I mean, this is this is paradise. Right. This is right. paradise. And you're living next to paradise. I'll tell you what. I'm spoiled. Can do that every morning. I know, but what what's amazing is there's people that live here that never come to the beach. Oh, really? Yeah, they oh. don't. Then they can live everywhere else. Yeah, it's amazing. I have friends that maybe they'll go to the beach once a year or something. Oh, really? Yeah. I know people when they they they. 
they hear me say that, they're like, what? Are they crazy? <laughs> well, yes, they're my friends, so they have to be crazy. You'd be out here every morning, every day, every, right. every chance, right? Every chance right. you could get. Right. It's, I mean, it's, it's good for your mind. You know, it's good for your body, your right. mind, your soul. Right. It's, you hear it's therapy. The waves. Yeah. And it's, the weather. Yeah. That's, that's beautiful. And even the smells. You know, you breathe, get some fresh air. Right, get, right, right. No, it's gorgeous. That's, Every time a good idea. <laughs> That's why I'm here. <laughs> Amen. Amen. That's why Roy lived at the beach. Right. <laughs> Roy right, pretty right. much lived at the beach. He would have lived here if he could have. He was here every every day. Yep. Rain or shine. Right. He did not care about the weather. All right, we need some dolphins now. Just for you, Norbert. <laughs> Just for you. I saw some in uh, Clearwater. In Clearwater? Yeah. And that's a little too far for me to walk. Uh, right. <laughs> that was a few days ago. Nice. I was with Mom. She, she saw a dolphin here. At, at the park? Yeah. Here. Good, good, good. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, at the beach. Yeah. They, um, you okay. see them up at the, in the pass, you know, up at the end of the park okay. here. You, you see them in there in the morning. Yes. No, we, we saw them here. Oh, yeah. This area here. Yeah, they, they're out there. They are somewhere. They are curious. <laughs> Watching people. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they do. <laughs> I think, I swear, I think they know when everybody's taking pictures of them. I think so. Looks like that. Yeah. <laughs> and people are collecting shells. Oh yeah. That's amazing. We never run out of shells. <laughs> no. They just keep collecting and collecting. What amazes me is when you look at these shells and you see millions of shells here on the beach. Right. Millions. They, they were all alive they, at one time. You know, there was something living inside of all those and little shells. there's more. Yeah. There's Where did more. they all go? <laughs> <laughs> there's so many of the leftovers. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. Give everybody a look back up the beach here. Remember, there's a mile long stretch of beach here waiting for you at Del Norwegans. Just be patient. They're working on rebuilding the interior of the park now, but it's going to be several years before they get the new facilities, bathhouses, and I don't know what they're going to do. There's going to be boardwalks and picnic areas. I don't know. I haven't seen the plans yet. I've been invited to take a look at the plans. I need to do that. Like I said, it's going to be years. So be patient. But come out and enjoy this beautiful beach. I'm sure eventually they're going to have another parking lot or two opened up. Find a way to get here. Call my friend Christine at Naples Park Shuttle. Have her bring you over here to the beach if you're up in Naples Park or Vanderbilt Beach. Have her shuttle you to and from. Naples, Naples Park and Beach Shuttle. Look her up on Facebook. Free transportation tips only. Don't be a cheapskate. Please tip. People do need to eat. Like me. <laughs> If you enjoy my videos and appreciate what I do, appreciate my efforts, tips are always appreciated here. You can find a link to my PayPal account in the description of this post. I love just standing here looking up that beach. I love it. Moving up to the other end of it, 
on Sunday. Took a walk up to Wiggins Pass, the north end of the park. That was fun. Check it out. And down at this end of the park, you get, this is technically the park here. People kind of come in and just kind of squat. They don't pay their entrance fees and just kind of sit down here at the end. So remember, you are on the park property down here. And technically, you're supposed to be paying an entrance fee. So what's on your agenda for today, Norbert? I don't know. You don't know? I have nothing on Oh, nothing? Just relaxing. Amen. I will see. A good breakfast. A good breakfast. Yeah. I know a good place. I was there yesterday. Did you go over there? <laughs> I was there yesterday. <laughs> what would you, what'd you have? Oh, just an omelet. Just an omelet. Well, yeah. just an, that's what they're all about over <laughs> there is omelets. Did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what they're all about, omelets, man. Yeah, and it was good. Which one did you get? What was it? Texan? Texan? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I love the um, the Reuben omelet. Okay. It's got corned beef and yeah. the Swiss cheese and sauerkraut. Oh. Mm. <laughs> I, I, have I, mean, I have sauerkraut at home, you know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you have a lot of sauerkraut, I bet, at home. <laughs> <laughs> I love sauerkraut. I love cabbage. Oh. Yeah, I do too. <laughs> my grandma on my dad's side, my grandmother, she was German. So My mom uh, does a lot of cabbage. Mm, I love it. And it gets along okay with me. Some people can't eat it. Right, you know, right. Boy, it is so beautiful out here. Okay. Yeah, because like I said, I'm going to go down to the other end okay. where I started. But um, I'll touch base with you. I'll touch base with you. And we'll see what if we can get together again before you head out of here, before you leave Fort Myers. I think I'll go there this morning again to have some breakfast. Over to House of Omelets? Yeah, I think so. You need to let them know you're my friend. You'll see that the guy that's walking around on the floor, his name is Eli. Okay. And that's one of the owners. It's two brothers. Yeah, yeah and right. The one's in the kitchen. There's, uh, they are, uh, the guy who's always coming at the table and ask if everything is okay. Yep, that's Eli. Yep. Let him know that you're my friend. He'll get it. Tell him you came from Germany just to have breakfast there. <laughs> I can you say you saw it on Facebook and you had to come. <laughs> that's I, the only reason you came to Naples. I, I was there in fall, uh, before. Oh, yeah? Yeah. There, it's not, it was not open when I was here with mom. I don't think so. Maybe it's just opened. But we were only Yeah, you know, it, they opened like... Because you were here just before COVID. Yeah. They, long, they, long, long time. Long, before long before. COVID. They opened like, I think maybe a year before COVID. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now they have... He had a partner and they have another one in Fort Myers. Well, they have... Ah, okay. There's one in Cape Coral and one in Fort Myers. Okay. But that's, that's his old partner has that. Ah, okay. And he has this one. Ah, okay. And they want to open another one here in Naples, but they can't find any help. They've been looking for you need, you a need, couple years. You he, need a lot of people to work yeah, there. Yeah, he can't find a good cook. Yeah. It's very frustrating nowadays. A lot of people, it's you know, people don't want to work. They got used to working at home.
You gonna call it a morning? Hmm? You gonna call it a morning? No. Oh. oh, okay. <laughs> Lunch time over there. It is. Yeah. <laughs> Just when you get adjusted. <laughs> I think mom, she's taking a nap at this time right now. Wow. That's, that's her time. So she's not answering. What is four hours? Five. Five, five, uh, five, five hours. hours. Five. We change the uh, time uh, next weekend. Oh. Then it's, six, then it's six hours again. Okay. Yeah, we get some some folks, some friends on here with this from all different parts of the world. Right, right. And some of them are having dinner. <laughs> <laughs> some are having lunch. <laughs> yeah, when I'm at home having uh, lunch. I turn on your video. <laughs> right. Yeah, sometimes I do, yeah. It's not a morning walk for you. It's, no. a, it's a lunch walk. <laughs> that's funny. I don't care. As long as you watch, that's okay. Right. That's right. all that matters. <laughs> See, that's that's what I like seeing. I like seeing the, the different generations out together, right. you know, picking up the shells on the beach. So right. The mom, the grandma, the, the grandkids. It's like Can't, I never found a shark to you. Never. I no. I don't. I don't see them. There. There. It takes a little bit to to get an eye for them. Right. And they're, they're not, there's not a lot of them here on this beach. Okay. You have to go a little further up to the north. Oh, okay. In between here and Tampa, there's some really good, good okay. places. Okay. Be Venice, Venice Beach is okay. there. It's world famous. Mm -hmm. Somebody just found a huge one up there. Wow. Last week. I mean, our friend Bill, we used to call him Shark Tooth Bill. Oh. He, he, he used to hang out with Roy. And he um, he found a big one here, okay, a month, two months ago. But it was it was in the ground, straight like that, and just the top was sticking out. And he thought it was a rock. Oh. And he, he thought it was maybe a fossil. So he started pulling it, and then this wow big tooth came out. Oh really? Yeah, huge. Wow. Huge. <laughs> wow. Yeah, he was very excited. <laughs> I think so. I'd be excited too. <laughs> It doesn't take much to get me excited. A dolphin. Yeah. <laughs> I get excited with my dolphins. The nature. That's it. Yeah. That's good. Clouds. I like looking at the clouds. Now all of our clouds are gone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they disappeared. It's supposed to be back. I love clouds. It's, uh, it's going to be a nice day today. Yeah, it's today, tomorrow should be good. Yeah. Then it's going to cool down a little bit okay. for us. You know, for you. Yeah. For us, it's cool. For <laughs> other people, it's not cool. It's it's a heat wave. <laughs> but when it gets into the 50s, <laughs> it'll be, I think, the same 55 in the morning. And then the sun comes up and psh, it's beautiful. I just, when it's windy, that's what I don't like. If it's, if it's cool and not windy, it's fine. But when it gets windy out here, eh, on that's when Friday. I, yeah. A lot of rain. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Yesterday, it was windy. Right. In the, in the afternoon. Right? Yeah. Today, it's going to be windy again. But not like uh, it's, uh, last Friday. No. A uh, friend from Cape Coral picked me up. And we went to have some dinner together. Uh -huh. I was glad I did not have to walk or something mm. because it was so much rain. Yeah. 
That was our rain day. Anybody wishing they were out here walking with us right now? So do you ever see ads in Germany on TV for Naples? Uh, no. For our tourism? No. Yes. That's not. Good. <laughs> we have enough people here. <laughs> <laughs> I know they advertise, they used to advertise a lot, but, uh, all, at, you know, all around the world, but. Um, there's a lot of people going to Florida. Yeah. It's from, like, from I think, I don't think we have to advertise anymore. No. no. <laughs> And now it's now it's more internet too. Everything's on the internet instead of television. Yeah, there's one building up here. I meant to show that to you when we were walking down. We'll go. Hey, you go down here and that. That'll be enough for you. <laughs> and on every first floor, they are working on it. Oh, yeah. Every single one. I mean, yep, the water was splashing up to the second floor. Oh, my God. Yeah. There was, we were talking to a guy that stayed in that condo right by the park, the first one there. Mm -hmm. um, forget what that's, Mariah Bay. And... He stayed in there, and on the second floor is their lobby, and it's just all glass. You know, you look out to the water. Oh, and he was God. standing there watching the water, and then he said it started coming up and hitting the windows right. up on the second floor, and he's like, uh, I probably shouldn't have stayed here. <laughs> you, were, you were not here. I, we were here. You well, were? I, wa I mean, I wasn't on the beach. No, 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 but at your house. Yeah, yeah, we stayed because our house was above the level where they said that the water was going to come. We were about a foot higher yeah. than where the storm surge was. But we were in a mandatory evacuation. It was, we were, it was a Tuesday afternoon. And a lot of times... Tuesdays we go to this place called Tacos and Tequila okay and Taco Tuesday you know yeah, that, that's right. where they have that's what they right. call it here <laughs> I and know, I know. and um, everybody in the whole restaurant right at about it was just before five o'clock everybody's phone goes off you know this loud sound and then an announcement yeah get out everybody everybody on this side of 41 it was mandatory but that doesn't mean you have to. All that means is they don't have to come and take care of you. Right. If something happens right. during the storm, the and emergency a, response isn't obligated. Your own risk yep. to, stay, to, to stay here. I mean, some people left. The people along the beach, definitely, most of them got out of here. But, of course, me. Yeah, better, better to leave. That was the... Uh, that was the signal for me and my friend Robert to get in his truck and start driving around <laughs> and go check things out. And that was a bad idea. <laughs> we got, we totaled his truck driving around. We went underwater. Oh, really? Yep. Oh. Yep, the water just was coming in and we hit a, a low spot in the road and the water just came right up over the hood. Oh. And then we first we ran over a tree that was under the water. You don't see it. Right. Hit a tree that got knocked over. And then we flooded. And the truck still ran. It, it took about two days and then it died. The whole electrical system was messed up. Yeah, right. We were without power for yeah. a long time. Well, our house, we didn't have power for Oh, a week, I think, a week. Okay. A week or two. I, maybe, I, we have a generator, but I didn't, 
feel like getting the generator out and getting it all set up. Yeah, so yeah. the day the day I get the generator out and it was brand new. We just bought it. Yeah. Get it get it set up. You need that. The power came on about five hours later. Oh okay. <laughs> You need a generator for the freezer and the yep. kitchen, so... Yep. Good morning. Good morning. This, this little building up here... This one... I didn't think, I did not think this building that was going to stay here. I thought there, there's one there's talking about tearing down. It's up here to the left a little bit. Okay. But I thought this was going to go. You could look right through the, I mean, it just took everything out. There, there was nothing in it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was just, you could look right through the bottom floors here. I saw it on your video when you walked around here. But you can see the street from here. Yeah. I mean, it's amazing that they're it's coming back. rebuilding. That's good. Yeah. Hopefully, they're rebuilding stronger. You know? Hopefully, everything will last. The next hurricane will come. We can't do it. We can't stop it. No. We can't stop Mother Nature. No. She's going to do what she wants to do. And right. She's telling us, why did you build all that stuff on my beach? Why did you put all those buildings on my beach? She did not like that. I'm not a big fan of all of this, you know. It's, I like Del Norwegans. Right, right. I love the natural beach, but hey, it is what it is. You can't stop progress. True. Well, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm I not think good. I will go back. All right, Norbert. It's good okay. seeing you. I'll touch base with you. Yep. We we will talk. Okay, sounds okay. good. It was Have nice chatting day. with you. Yep. Tell all your friends goodbye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> oh, that was fun. That was fun seeing Norbert. Wow, it's cleared up here. It's supposed to be partly cloudy, I thought. Right now, it's not partly cloudy. It's gorgeous. battery I've got left here but I'll keep going until I get my battery warning I didn't notice any moon jellyfish yet on the beach I did see some the other day when I was out here Sunday of the Del Norwegian saw a couple of them walking down the beach just looking at this the waves as they come on shore there as they just like make their way towards me walking the line <laughs> that water feels great
Oh, I'm jealous. Norbert's going over to House of Homeless. My stomach's saying, oh, wait for me, wait for me. go back and check out this morning's daybreak live feed the replay of this morning's daybreak live feed nice colors nice colors this morning if you like what you see hit the share button that helps Facebook stars if you appreciate what I do I get a penny for each star that you send to my videos on Facebook doesn't have to be a live feed any old Facebook video, just about any old Facebook video you can send stars to. I'm going to go check with my friend Paulo at the Vanderbilt Beach Resort. Find out what the status is of the Turtle Club restaurant. Maybe I'll share a little update about that with you later. Oh, there goes my battery. Honey. That's a beautiful morning. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I do. Just love coming out here. I just love being able to share it. That's what's so nice. Sharing my beach time with you. Alright my friends, that's going to do it for this morning's beach walk. Please tell your friends about Southwest Florida Television. Invite them into our Southwest Florida Television Beach family. We're going to get room for new members in our family. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally-ho, everyone. Tally-ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. May God bless you, your family, your friends, your fur babies, everything and everyone in your life. God bless our wonderful country. God bless America. Tally-ho. Tally-ho.